All right, howdy there. Today I am bringing you a lose all sports tutorial. But before I, you know, I go over the actual like gameplay of it. First, I'm going to go over the skill level you want to be at, because that's the most important thing. Because <laughs> if you're set up wrong, then the run won't go well. For tennis, you would want to have your skill around around a thousand, at, at least, at least a thousand, I'd say, or just at least facing Elisa and uh, Sarah. As long as you're facing them, your skill doesn't really matter, but I just have it at 2222, because it's kind of a funny number. Alright, baseball skill, you want... <sighs> baseball, it's personal preference, really, on who you face. I have mine at, I think, 1075, which is a pretty good, good amount. I'd say anywhere between 900 and just under 1100. The higher it is, the better they'll do on... When you're, pitch when you're pitching to them, but the harder it is to bunt, and vice versa. Uh, bowling skill literally doesn't matter. You don't have tutorials. Uh, golf, you want to do a nine-hole game, and I think just get over par or under par. As long as you don't have the golf tutorial, your skill doesn't matter. In boxing, you want to have it 1,500 plus and be facing Matt. That one's, that one's pretty easy, but yeah, some people... I mean, I used to have a lot of trouble to get getting up in skill in boxing, but all of a sudden I was good at it one day. So, yeah, you want to have your boxing skill up high. I mean, you could do it around 1100, but it's just, it's easier just to face map, quite honestly. Alright, we'll start, tutorial will start with just to show you how to play tennis. It's very, very simple. Probably the easiest thing in the run. So for serving, you want to hit the ball like that, right at its apex. Now, I should have hit that out, but I'm just trying to show off the serve. So up, and it's going out. Boom. Simple. It's going to take some practice to get uh, consistent with it, but once you know it, you're good. Now, once it says second bounce right there, you can quit out. Kaboom. Alright, now on to baseball. This isn't going to be a full run of lose all sports in tutorial form. I'm just going to show off, you know. But it's just better to demonstrate. Yes, yeah, see, 1075 skill. I got Takumi, which is one of the six you can face at the skill level. Now for bunting, I like to have... See, that was a perfect bunt. I like to see her. Mm. Try to show off. I, w I like having the shadow of the bat a little bit over the plate. Splitters, you gotta swing at. You don't want to. You do not want balls. All right, on an 0 and 2 count or just anything with two strikes, just swing. That was an unlucky at bat, but that's what happens in lose all sports. I'll just have it angled a little bit. See, he's throwing a bunch of splitters. It's a good thing this isn't a real run. That is bad splitter luck right there. Yeah, don't bunt on two strikes. It's a little faster to strike out. Alright, now on to pitching. Pitching is fully RNG based. With a few sort of exceptions. So, what you want to do, you want to... Well, the thing I do, I just... I throw screwballs as fast as I can. Normally they hit them. Ooh, see that's really good. That's something you want. You want them to hit singles and then hit a home run. Because you want them to win 5 nothing ideally. So, for right-handers... Whoops, didn't mean to throw that. Okay, it worked out pretty well. That's a good double. For right-handers, I throw fast screwballs. For left-handers, I'm going to throw fast curveballs. I just think that's better. You can throw whatever you want, though. Oh, come on. But do not throw, like slow pitches, like really slow, like 64, like that, because normally, I don't know, honestly, <laughs> I don't have great advice, but it's, just throwing it fast is better, because the ball goes faster, woohoo, alright, let me just, and yeah, another thing, foul balls, it's just, it's tough.
<sighs> Alright. I'm gonna just try to show off something. So let's see. I forget who's up to bat, quite honestly. I haven't played these all sports in a while. Sarah. Oh. Oh, come on. I'm barely moving my Wiimote too, that's the annoying thing. Alright. So yeah, basically just hope they score five runs. I don't really have any more advice. Um, if you want them to hit a home run, I notice with right-handers, the best thing you can throw them- Oh, it's not a bit. Is like a 72 curveball. Let me try to get one to Theo. I threw him an 85, apparently. Yeah, that one was too slow. I'm just gonna pop that up into the center field. Yeah. So, sadly that wouldn't give me a mercy rule. So I'd have to play another inning, because you want to lose 5-0 in the first inning, but they don't do that every time. So. Alright, now on to bowling. Bowling, I'm not going to show off the uh, the weird no, like no back swing, I guess, is the best way to describe it thing. Because you're not going to be doing that if you're starting out. Like, that is something I don't even know if I'd go for for a high 7-3x. Well, basically, what you want to do, I'm going to hold the weird mode out. Just A, over. Mm. It's that simple. You don't want to spam A, you just want to. Because if you spam it too much, like right here, you might mess yourself up and then go like that. It's more just knowing the timing, like right here you can spam it. And then when you hear that, the noise, like the bring, I'll tell you what noise right now. This one. On a press, yeah, you can spam it until you hear that noise. And then... All right. That's pretty simple. You can exit out of uh, this game when it says game finished at the end. It's pretty obvious I'm not gonna play through all 10 frames though to see it because that seems like a waste of time. Baseball you can exit when it says mercy rule when you lose 5 nothing. Just, just want to let you know that. Alright, golf. This is one of the hardest parts of the run at first, then it's one of the easiest. You want to play intermediate because it's fastest. By a lot, too, I think. Alright, I'm going to attempt to demonstrate to you fast turning. It's not... I don't know, I'm not the best at it. If you want, go check out Roadrunner's channel. I'll try to put the link in the description if I even remember. So, you, what you want to do... Well, to start, you club up to driver, okay? Oh, this is going to suck. Alright, um... So basically, do not let go of the, the right arrow. Move up. Okay, well here, I'm gonna have to move back over. You wanna move over to about here. Oh, come on. About here. And then swing. If you did it right, boom, you had to turn fast. So, you turn fast, club up to driver, swing as hard as you can. You can't fast turn on stroke five, because you gotta set the fast turn back up again. Because you want to use driver every time. Alright, now that that's out of the way. Holes 5 and 6, very easy. No fast turning involved, you just turn a bit this way. And you hit it into the water. And you just do this a whole bunch of times, so... just going to skip until we hit hole 6, just so I can show you that. Alright, we're on our final stroke here. Alright, and it's a, you don't even have to move for this one. Just boom. Seems pretty simple. But, the only thing with this... So now, if you have a Wii U, you'd have to hit this... You'd have to hit the home button, reset, and then yes. 
after a, after give up appears on this hole, that is. Can't do it right now. If you have a Wii, you can just hit the reset button on the on the console. Right now, I'm just I'm just gonna hit the reset button on my console. I forgot to almost forgot my nunchuck too, so I'll put that in now. See when that when give up appears, reset. Also, uh, you can just hold down A and B, like while the whole thing's coming up, and it'll do it on the first frame. Now, I'm just gonna finish it up with the boxing. This is very, this is very, very easy too. Let's see, fifteen thirty-three. Want to hold Wii Remote and Nunchuck kind of out like this. And then keep them still. Don't like shake your Wii Remote or anything. Just keep them nice and still. And there you go. So that that's about it. There's not there's not too much else to the run. Like I said, pitching is kind of up to you what you throw. Do not throw splitters and do not throw anything but in the middle though. Anything but that's just kind of detrimental. So that's that's about it. Stay thick and safe. Mwah. See you.